Hello everyone and welcome back to the World of Risk. We're playing Classic Fix today with true random dice. Because why not? I'm anonymous from Germany. And I'm, I'm this pretty girl here with the old green. The green stuff going on. You're green, Jimmy? Okay. So I got sniped by a, a member in chat and he's also green. So you should see two green colors this game. We're, get, we're getting real frisky this morning. Uh, it is early morning stream and people are amped and ready to go uh classic fixed true random dice with alliances on because i'm not forgetting that again and that's it bots are automated so they do move and attack and that's it basic old juicy juice good stuff uh watch this watch this flags right united states germany mongolia oh crap spain I looked at them in the lobby and I'm like, I'm going to remember these flags and I'm going to ace my flags test. And I remembered Mongolia, I think. Because that's not Mongolia. But I forgot the other one. Greece! No, I remembered it was Greece. No. I had it. I had it. I was going to come in and I was going to slap all the flags. And I slapped. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Sheldon plays fun with flags. Okay. Uh, what do I do? This sucks. Uh... I don't like this at all. Good. Stack here. Do we go big D for Australia? I don't know. Don't think that we do. <laughs> Chat slapped Kilted for trying to show up. Yeah. I was too twi- Look at Blue's spawn! Look at this! That's disgusting. Why doesn't that happen to me? And- you have South America! Get away from Australia, you potato! He lost nothing! Oh my god, do it! You're, you're, you have to! Oh my god, what is wrong with you? Blue could have very easily made top two in this game and maybe won it if he just played less suicidal. I mean, Red's going to add his six troops here and roll an eight on four, maybe. And then Black's going to add three and come in with this. And then I might add three and come in with, like, there's stuff that's going to happen. And Blue's going to quit very shortly. Purp is going to go left. Blue will be quitting very shortly. Um... He rolled my four stack with a six and lost nothing. That's a uh, true random. You have to deal with that. Yep, and now he gets butt plungered over here. Red's gonna come in here. If Red doesn't come in here, then he does get to hold Australia. Because I'm not gonna come through Red into a four. <laughs> Blue is high. Blue is the luck god. What? What are you doing? I mean, you guys giving me Europe? I'll take Europe. Yeah, get all the get out of my way. If these get out of my way, I would love to come up and go to Europe. I don't want to go suicidal for Australia. Come on, Red. Bum ba ba. I don't have my uh, emotes on this account. I want the where he's raising his gun above his head. <clears throat> no South America, no one. No, he's gonna go for Europe, dude. Break, break Australia. Be more crazy. Be loco. Okay, he's going for North America. Hey, Kilted, would you like to take... Would you like to take Europe? Why, yes. Yes, I would. I'm going to bring this five up soon. I need any of these three to get out of my way to start moving left. <laughs> What's black going to do? He gets a three. Red's now in here. Hey, wait, red's pointed at South America. Oh, what is... Everybody wants South America? Is this like the new hot place to be? Card blocked in South America? No, it's South America, no win. Right. Hey, Kilted. Do you have ten minutes to speak about our Lord and Savior, Leroy Jenkins? I have a YouTube video for you. Oh, Black's going to get out of here and come into Europe now? Don't you run, you chicken wuss. Mm. Uh, 
I want through. Let me out. Let me out. Okay, we got a dude in artillery. We need a cavalry. So I do have a you I, I do have a Leroy Jenkins video. What are the odds he's rolls a six on six? Because I know the odds of odds of winning it are like low. Jesus, this guy's dice are godly. Just smacks a two, no fear. Does he leave South America? <laughs> no, he does not. <laughs> Get out. Blue is loco? Blue is loco. Absolute loco. Like, is pink one in on this action? You guys should just have a big orgy in South America. What's that uh, resort in Jamaica? Hedonism. You guys should just all go there and have a big bunch of fun. Go get him, Kung Fu Panda. From Greece. Don't ask me how I know about that resort. I gotta Google vacation destinations. I have to find stuff out about the world. Why is... Maybe red's... No, red's three still in my way. I want this way, purple. You suck. I want left with this five stack. I need to get it in here. Pink's trying to get his seven in here. There's a chance he hits my five because it's stuck. Help me step, bro. I'm stuck. True random sec. Uh, is my three go away now? No. You jump into the orgy. Come on, if you go here to Venezuela and Pink goes to Brazil, you guys can have a four-way in there. It would be exceptional. Black, stay. Yeah, Black, you need to take North America and give me Europe. You don't want to fight me. Red's going down for some reason. Yeah, and he's going to bring this three into here. Or this three. You really want my five trapped. Don't like you. I will try to take a card. Screw it. I'm like, if I lose the two on one, I won't roll a second one. And I did roll a second one, because why not? It happened. It happened. <laughs> Everyone wants everything. I don't know what's happening. Be a Chad take EU. I'm trading and taking EU right now. What is happening? What is this bongo stuff going on? People are going to have trades on three. Not only this, blue is very un not guarded in so uh, Australia. So black could... Any of us could gank this with a big trade. I could technically gank it with an 18 stack. I don't want to. Pink wants an alliance. I accept. Purple, get out of my bonus. You opened my five, but now you're in my bonus. Okay. That's even more annoying. I don't like you. Um, do I put purple in one position? I think I do. Pink wants to ally me because he wants to go for Africa while I go for Europe, which I'm cool with. Egypt, Greenland, Venezuela. I'm not going to hold any of those. So, uh, as you can see, I'm not going to hold my cards. I'm just going to trade them. Kilted, I think cards hate me almost as much as you. I've counted every 8 to 10 set in the last week. One 8 set, three 10 sets. The rest are mostly 4 or 6 on 5 cards. Sounds about right. I mean, like, we joke about, like, the dude sets and stuff, but I don't remember, okay, I don't remember days where I've had, like, just straight cavalry all day. Five cavalry, seven cavalry in a row, or artillery, five or seven in a row. I haven't had any of that. I've had so many five or seven dude days in a row. 
You'd think it would average its way out. Send the heart to black and pink and black. Don't break me. I'm probably okay. Red wants an alliance. I'm going to accept it. Anybody that doesn't break me right now is my friend. I also knocked purple out of here and fed his three cards. There's also a chance black trades and smacks that and takes that right now. Oh, he has the trade on three. But he can't get to me. He's got to go through all the... Blue loses this position. And Black kills him over here. And he loses only two on a nine stack. Lose 19 on a one. That'd be hilarious. All right. <laughs> so now he's like card blocked in here. So now Red and Black contest this. Black kills Blue. Pink could kill... No. Pink could maybe kill Blue. With good dice. He doesn't, though, I don't think. No, he doesn't. He wants Africa. Go right and then down, and I thumbs up you, and then we're friends. Yeah. Yeah, give you a thumbs up. We're best friends. Dude, if red and black don't break me, we are in this game. What does red do? Red maybe can't even break me, unless he's got a trade. He can't break me. And that's like six, five, four. Like, that would be suicide. There's absolutely no point to try that. Is this on true random? Yes, we're playing true random. We joke about it, but it pisses me off so much. I haven't pulled a single cannon in the last three days, except two off of kills. <laughs> yeah, it, it's fun. It's a fun uh, meme, but it. I don't understand why I just get so many dudes. I believe there's more dude cards in the decks than other cards on certain maps. I don't know exactly the numbers, but. Good evening. What's up, Dr. Vamps? Black is thinking. I mean, you're not going to break me. We have an alliance. Doesn't kill blue. Left and then down, down, down. He could feed red. Bro, hit that 13. Do it. Hit it and kill the 13. I will marry your sister. Nope, I won't do it. Take it back. And full stack here on the 13. Point it down. Oh, baby. Red's about to trade. <clears throat> okay. He wants me to hit red. Uh, how do I do this? One second. Red's about to trade, right? And if he doesn't, he's going to come through here. Okay, everybody wants me to hit red. That was painful. I'm guarded from red. <laughs> um, red trading and coming through and hitting me could ruin my game. Uh, but uh, if he doesn't trade, black's going to kill him. And then black and I have a decent alliance. Pink and I, pink and black both wanted me to do that. 
So, uh, me, I didn't want to hit it, but I did it because of the alliances at this point, right? It's tricky. The reason I didn't want to do it is if red trades and comes through and hits me because I hit his three, that's my game's sunk or really bad. But if he doesn't, my game's really good and my alliances with black and pink are stronger now. Purple's also card blocked, doesn't take a card. Ends up just chilling. We're almost got blue card blocked. If we took this two out, blue would be card blocked till he moves his 17 up. 69 dudes in the deck. True random giveth and true random taketh. True. Like blue hitting my four stack and losing nothing. And I'm so scared. Even rolling an 18 on a three, I'm like, you can just see minus 17 and you lose the roll. <laughs> Big trade. What's he doing with it? He's undecided. Oh, please. If he goes loco on black, I can maybe kill both of them. Because I can come right through here and get black over here. Well, I, I wouldn't get the kill on black, but... He doesn't. He does nothing. Still card blocking purple, though. And stopping black from the bonus. If you're red, do you almost consider running out here? Slowly? Maybe one turn at a time? Or maybe two spaces at a turn? Uh, I wish he hit the black too. Oh no, yeah, he's connecting all his stuff so he can get in. I see what he's doing. He wants to bring that to the 16 to combat with red. So this fight is good for me. Uh, blue, blue getting knocked out of here by purple is good for me. Purple being card blocked is good for me. Um, pink is in a strong spot. He's going to be able to get cards and hold a bonus. I'm in a strong spot. Get cards, hold a bonus. Red stack doesn't have access to me now. Uh, he says attack pink, but I'm going to do something completely different than that. I'm going to go here, take a card, come back to Ukraine. So I, I kind of want to build a stack on each side. Three borders are fine. The 15 and the 10 are good. I might move the four off into the 10. It doesn't guard Western Europe, then, very well if pink breaks, but I think pink and I have a good alliance. We need a dude! What's up, Gaz? One, two, three, welcome to the stream. Thank you for the follow. Uh, I am quicker if I did miss your follow earlier and you're still hanging out. Thank you as well. Yeah, Dr. Vamps, good to see you also. You said evening. It's morning for me. It's uh, 9.16 a.m. Hey, one shot. I haven't seen you in forever, man. How are you doing? It has been a minute. Like a month. Since, like, the Legends tournament or something. It's always evening with me. Oh, okay. 2.16 for Hanny. Oh. Please succeed getting a card. Take the blue one. Preferably the blue one. Good guy. Good, good, good. We're laughing. We're not too far ahead. Uh, we're only 40 troops to Black's 35. Losing my four stack here. And, and uh, I don't know, whatever else, I guess, has got me a little bit lower than... And I've only held the bonus for two turns, so that's only 10 troops. All right, red is taking a card and coming back down. The thing is, if red comes out, purple comes up. And then it's a three-way. Then hedonism's in Central America. Actually, it's kind of close. It's somewhere in here, right? Yeah, before Christmas, for sure. Yeah, definitely. Uh, nice. Give me my 10 troops, or 8 troops, baby. Knock black under 12, or... Kind of want to keep going this way. Dude! Let's go. Big trade. 
48 troops and big trade. Now we're starting to look scary, scary, scary. <clears throat> and so the, the, the presumption here for me is I do want to keep this stack here for two reasons. I want to dissuade red from coming in and breaking me. But also, if black and red fight, they go immediately before me. Turn order matters. Um, I can trade now and with my bonus on the 15, clean up whatever's left over of these two. Red might be suiciding right now. We don't know. Um, black doesn't have very much out here. I can also, and the other reason I'm taking cards up this way is so my 17 can get through if I need to clean up black. Like I can double kill black and red if they go to war right now with three and four cards. So I'm, I'm paying attention to now pink's blocking my 17, unfortunately. I'm going to give him a thumbs up. Because now we have a block. We're blocking Asia off. Uh, I hope he hits Afghanistan and opens my stack. But until then, I have to deal with this. This is part of our agreement. He wants to defend two borders and not three. It makes sense. Uh, the war is not happening yet. Unless black trades. Black might trade and kill red right now. If he trades, he goes down to one card. Kills red for four. Trades again, goes down to two cards, ends his turn owning North America with three cards in hand. But how low will his troops be after that? Now Red's just pointed at me. Why are you going up there? If he hits red even remotely here, I will kill red. I would love him to let me kill red. Or he can kill red. I don't want to roll a 28 stack for four cards. Come on, attack red, please. Hit him with 10 troops. 10 and I finish. No. Mm. Peru or Central America? I'm going to own neither of those anytime soon. Hmm. Leave me alone. <laughs> Don't you dare think about coming through Europe. There's two ways I could have done this. I could have moved away and let him break my Europe. And then be a thorn in my side while Black gets North America, holds it for a while, gets strong. Uh, while Pink gets stronger. Uh, there's also a chance Purple comes in and takes cards on North America. But I have a giant commanding lead, and if I put a 42 there, are you really going to blitz your entire stack into me? Presumably he gets a trade. Maybe he has a plus two on this territory, and he moved up here to get the plus two. But say he gets a 10 with the plus two, and is three for a turn, it would be a 43 on 42. This might be very risky doing this, but... Uh... Also, if he doesn't have a trade on four and he loses some troops going left, I will kill him for five cards. Send him a heart. Let's attack black. No, he didn't have the plus two there. Okay, it works. Nice, and he's moving out. That That's great. That's actually great. He is going to concede North America to Black. So Red's, Red's a decent player. I respect that a lot. Uh oh, is he going for the kill on Blue in Australia? If he gets good dice. If he gets good dice, he kills him. Gets the trade. He kills him, or does he run out of time? Hey, 
<laughs> he does get it. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Blue's gone. Red's incredibly weak now. And he's going to be sitting on three cards at the end of his turn. 27 troops isn't that weak. Your hair looks different. Is it receding? No, I shaved my head, man. I'm going to get sued like Pepsi with the private jet. Oh, God. Nobody has redeemed it. If I get big enough where you have the channel points to redeem that private jet, I would be able to afford to get you a private jet. Yeah, he doesn't trust me there. I'm going to move most of my troops off of that. I'm going to show him good faith. My stack there was because of red. Let's see if he notices. He's more scared of pur He should be more scared of purple breaking him than me, because I have no intention of, of making that fight. I think I've been reasonably clear on that. Um, okay, we got a dude and two double cavalry. We need an artillery. We're also 72 troops. We're looking really strong. Would pink help me with red? See, if pink knocks two red out here and moves up, we're card blocking him, right? That would be nice. He hits the two red and comes here to card block. What's up, uh, Maxime Chess? Uh, welcome to the channel, sir. Come on, hit both of them and then move your 20 up. Move your... Oh my god, please, please. Uh, I needed the signal. You can attack my territory if you need to. I'm on 12. Red's going to take a card here, though. Hmm. If someone has enough points for the jet, they that person probably paid a big part for a big portion of it as well. Yeah, I would say so. Anybody on YouTube? There is uh, channel points you earn from watching a channel. I don't know how many you get in an hour, like 60 or 100 or something, or a couple hundred or 500. I don't know, but I have a redeem for like one and a half billion for a private jet. Nobody's ever going to get there. But if somehow someone did, it means I've streamed so much, I've made it. So uh, I would be able to purchase that. So it's not a scam. He had the trade on three also. Uh, triple cavalry trade. And zero cards. You're going to zero card Australia with the one point guard and not do anything? Here we go. Just do some rigged predictions. Yeah, if my mods rig it, that's not fair. Although 1.6 billion channel points is still crazy. Purple wants me to hit pink. Hey, Purple, how about new? No. I'm going to get to hold 12 territories because red didn't take a card. We're going to get nine this turn. So black's going to start... Oh, black had a trade on 3-2. Triple infantry. I'm sorry, bro. Trust me, I do know the feeling. It is the thing. Wild card. Let's go. We're getting good trades today. I mean, I know the dude thing happens, but uh, today it's not happening, and I am all for it. Plus 10 for 5 minutes, so about 200 points an hour. And then you get 50 if you click the little box that pops up sometimes, right? So, whatever that ends up being. Next kilted poop break, I'll rig up a channel point from someone. I've never taken a poop break on stream, but... My peas are so long because I drink so much coffee, you might think that. I, okay, so 
there was actually a warehouse I worked in and uh, when we'd go on break, cause I drank so much water and coffee, we'd go on break. I would be the first one in the bathroom and I would start my stream, my pee stream. And then people would come in, they would pee, they would wash their hands and then they would leave. And I would still be full stream. And then I'd come out like a minute or two later and they'd be like, what the hell, bro? How much water and coffee do you drink? And it is a lot. He might break me too. He doesn't break me. Because he was telling me to hit pink a bunch and I didn't. Pink's on 42 troops. I have a big trade. Four cards. No, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... Pink still got too many for me to kill. Unless, like, if Black knocked all of this out. That's what, 11? It would take him to 33? What's this? Yeah, 31 here. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Sorry, my brain's broken. I would take it as 31 for four cards. But then I would hold both of these bonuses. It would let purple out. Hmm. Black is thinking. He's going to... I don't blame him with this build up here. I don't think he wants to waste troops hitting this many. If he did, I would clean pink up. But I'm not going to signal to him to hit pink. Because right now I have a good alliance with black. If black doesn't want to hit pink and I signal that, maybe he gets slightly angry feeling like I'm trying to manipulate or something. I don't need to trade right now. So we're going to do this. Oh my god, I'm losing so many troops on these. Uh, I will bring the four out. Uh, double dude, double cavalry, and the old wild card. That's cool. We do have a plus two on Iceland. So we're going to look at this scenario. I, I also would love to give Pink an opportunity to respond to Red. Because he may respond to Red by killing him. He may respond to Red by just making Red weaker. Not killing him. But, like, let, let's let this fight play out. Or does he come up here and chill? Or is he three-point guard? No, he goes up and blocks that. Okay. He traded for cavalry again. Triple cavalry. I was saying I don't see them often. I'm seeing them now. Kilted, is it weird that I'm watching you while I'm in the bathroom? Maybe? No? Best to watch in the shower. What? Post-nut clarity always points me towards Kilted Stream. See, this is why I'm focused on the game and not Twitch chat. What the <laughs> Oh my god, you guys are hilarious. We all know you shake it more than twice by that smile on your face afterwards, Kilted. Damn. <clears throat> or because it has 17 inches to travel, P takes long. See, Hanny knows. It's the big boy slapper peener. See, now just because the chat's been great, this video has to go on YouTube, even if I get suicided in fifth place. Bro, what? What's up, Maxime? If we, is it weird if we watch it while we twist it? I mean... What in the world? I have to pay attention to the game. Stuff is... Purple wants me to hit pink. No. I'm leaving my study for watching you. Oh, uh, Muhammad, come on, man. You gotta do your you gotta do your college work, school work, whatever it is, right? You gotta do well in that. But uh thanks for hanging out at least. I do appreciate, of course. You know how I was talking about that 17 minute long pee? I'm getting close to needing one of those. Because I just woke up, nobody was streaming this morning, I'm like, I'll hop on! That, that means my morning coffee and water has uh, just gone into me and then I start stream up. What does that leave me with? It leaves me with getting an artillery this turn. That's what it leaves me with. <laughs> mm.
we got the artillery. Can pink see that I want to card block red? If pink sees the card block, red's in some trouble. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Come on, you see it, you see it, you see it. No! Card block him, bro! Ah, look what you've done to me, Kilted. What's up, man? What's up, Curlza? What did I do to you? I kept you awake? Oh, I was supposed to be in bed two hours ago? What's up, Vixum? Uh, thank you for the follow, sir. Red's coming out. Do I have to card block him myself? Yeah, he's trying to get out so he gets cards. I'm going to back my 15 off now because pink won't help me. If pink won't card block red with me, three cards for 22, it's really close, right? I mean, I have a big trade. Maybe I kill him? I kill him and concede Australia? Just to progress the game. Black's also getting really strong, right? So I would be risking quite the stack to go in and deal with him. Say I would make this a 33 or something. Come through. Purple can't do anything. Would black or pink get mad if I killed red and took that bonus? That's the question. Maybe I leave... Okay, maybe I take the bonus, but I leave a 2 on Siam and a 2 on Indonesia, and I take the rest and then fortify it to Ukraine. What if I did that? Nice slow attacks. Please stop screwing me. Yeah. Okay, they both are happy about that. I thought about leaving the, the 10 here, but then if they break it, they'll feel more like they started an act of war. Where a couple twos is enough of a, a bit of a bomb, they might let me have it. Give them both thumbs up. I took red out. We're final four. They're both happy. Uh, black didn't like red for this. Pink didn't like red for this. So I've made both of them happy. Purple's the only one that's got any reason to not like me because I won't hit pink for him. But he's got no ability to do anything about that. Now we're hunting for dudes. Okay. I like it. Let me hold the bonus, bro. I did you a favor. I did you a solid. Uh, I've got quite the lead in troops, too. And he opens my stack even more. <laughs> if I hadn't have left the two, it would have been a 69. I know. <clears throat> okay, so it being true random, these are better these are better defense than ones, surely. Me leaving a couple twos kinda persuades them a little less to hit me. Persuades them a little bit to leave it. But at the same time, if they don't leave it, I only lose two extra troops. So there's a higher percent chance they let me have it, just based on that. I could theoretically kill pink. I'm not going to, but if I kill pink, then I'm going to war with black and purple together, probably. And black and me are the same size or really close to it. So we're, we're going to have to let this purple thing play out. Um, if purple, yeah, and black might even just kill purple. If purple bots, it's automated bots. So it'll stack and try to roll. And I have 15 territories. I got 12 troops this turn. His thumbs downing me. Well, I'm sorry. But uh we got a dude. The the cards are just the cards are good. Good. 
Speaking of yuck, I'm going to watch Kilted in bed now. Damn, man. Thanks for hanging out, Carl if you're disappearing from the keyboard, though. It'll be nice to play with you again uh, if you get uh, more time with your promotion. Go to Grinder, good place for dudes. Ooh. The Kill Pete Strategies dude acquisition happens on Grinder. What's up, Volum SOP? Uh, welcome to the channel. Yeah, pink and black are fully pointed at purple, and I'm chilling fighting nobody right now. Purple's not happy with this. 69 troops for him, though. We'll do an, uh, an out of game dab. No way black and pink let you keep those? I got rid of Red, who they both hated. And I am okay. If if they take this, I don't care. But if they don't, I will just let it sit here like this. Neither of them wants to fight me with this giant stack. Black's trying to hit some of pink. I'm still on 15 territories. I get 12 troops if he doesn't hit one of my ones. Oh... Oh, what's going on here? He trapped his own stack here. Comes back a bit. Hmm. Iceland will take? Iceland sounds good. We have a 100 stack and another dude... With double cavalry, we just need artillery. Let's keep the big trades coming. 135. And we're holding Australia with a couple twos. Purple's still skipping. He's doing well, though. I mean, he's on 74 troops. He's matching pink, basically. <laughs> and here's another thing. Pink. Black's hitting pink ones. <sighs> And Pink wants to hit Black Ones back. He lost a six on one. Oh, that's disgusting. It happens, though. You just call, I'll come. I'll call you, Curlza. Curlza wouldn't even have to call me and I'd come. Jesus, guys. Hey, Kilted is using my Senorita and green color. Identity theft. True. <laughs> and I, I, my name shows as anonymous? But really, in-game, it's Mallory Lynn. Would you believe it? They're letting me hold 16 territories. I mean, pink wants me to hit black. Black wants me to hit pink. And I'm kind of just in here having a good grand old time. Uh, stacking on my 100 stack. And I'm going to get an artillery. And we're going to have the big trade. And it's going to be good. Okay, another horsey. That's fine. Sam played as you for weeks before anyone realized. I know. Uh, that Pete uh, waiting on your best behavior podcast with Fion. I thought that was you in that classic fixed game. Pink might hit me? Nope. Lost three on a one. He's getting really bad luck on the dice. The problem is... Okay, so... People that are watching and thinking I should probably do something crazy. If I kill pink, I'm going to lose 60 to 90 troops. Get a trade. I'll be on somewhere between, what, I don't know, 60 to 80 troops left over. I'll be the same size as purple, maybe. And I won't be able to card block purple. So purple comes out and black no longer needs to stack here. Black comes out. Now black is a monster and me and people are purple are weak. Right now, pink and black are so worried about purple, all of their troops are here, and this is going to collide, or this is going to collide, and I'm just going to keep getting bigger. So as much as some people may be like, make action happen, this position is I have a, a really, really good spot right now, and I don't want to mess that up, and I'm not planning on it. Um, if pink hits me, for example, I can kill him. If black hits me, I can retaliate within one turn, or actually the same turn. So, we did get the artillery. We are rocking the big trades back to back to back to back. And now my lead is growing. 12 a turn is huge. Huge. Just gotta wait for purple to do something? 
I think purple doesn't do anything. He's being very passive, very patient. He's actually got more troops than pink. Until pink trades. Black doesn't really have access to help me with pink. Okay, he does. Like, the second I start a fight, me and that person are going to drop considerably in troops. It's just not worth it. I'm wondering if at some point they're like, give me this. Yes, right now, pink and black have been good allies. Uh, I killed red for both of them. They both like me. I have good relationships with both of them. They both want me to hit the other one. And they're both sort of picking at each other a little in Asia. But as long as I do nothing, we're kind of laughing. Because they have a little bit of animosity, and then they have these stack buildups here with purple. So yeah, I just probably repeated myself there, but I mean, we, it is what it is. Uh, we'll take the Southern Europe plus two. Wait, where's Scandinavia? Up there? We'll take the Scandinavia one, actually. And we're not going to have... Oh, we've got all of these cards. Whatever. Look at the stack I've got. 181. Oh, good. Now we need to do it again. If you were playing, you would have already won. I believe it. I hate that. If I'm in the lead, I'm going to F things up. And if I'm not in the lead, I also F things up. <laughs> Why do black and pink not slow roll purple? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. The purple's opting to get broken here. To, to take a card. Instead of holding his bonus, he wants cards? That's risky and true random. Or is he going to back off and bring his 44 onto his 43 and then have a single stack in Peru so it's not threatening? That's actually decently smart. If he brings all of his troops off these borders, these guys might bring these troops out. Which means I might be at more at risk of getting in a fight. It also means black and pink might be more at risk at fighting each other. Like, it's possible if it was me, black and pink, and purple was gone, and it was just a three-player endgame, it's possible pink and black fight to the death. But they might be holding off because they don't want fourth place with purple sitting there. Hit black while you have the chance. I mean, like, I've had the chance always. There's no, there's no good reason to hit him. My lead is accruing quite heavily right now. See, he's thinking about bringing the 84 off now. Yeah. See this? Because he started to fortify back. Now Black's less scared of this. How much does he bring, though? Leaves a 60? <laughs> he ran out of time. <laughs> the best part about this is Pink doesn't have access with his stack to Australia. He'd have to trade to take it. <laughs> Black has access, though. Uh, no dude yet, but that's okay. Purple backs off with his 44 now. Now black probably backs off and leaves like a 12 or something. Brings like 71 troops here and makes his 100 stack. 100 plus. These guys are literally only hitting each other. This is crazy. Me holding 15 territories and these two bonuses is nuts. But it's... People are like, I would never let somebody hold that. But it depends on the position of your alliance with somebody, right? I would let somebody hold this if my alliance with them was good. Like in Black's position, I would also not be breaking green right here. I don't know how I would be playing Black's position, though. I'd have to think about it. Because I've been approaching this game from green's position. Also in pink's position, what would you be doing? You probably wouldn't be taking Australia from green either. Not with 150 stack, and it's a person you don't know their skill level or their aggression. Um, I did kill red. Did I also kill blue? He's leaving his five here. Mm. So I will hit the black one, so I can keep my stack open. I'm very specific in the cards I'm taking. 
Because now, oh my god, we we are getting the best trades all game. Because, okay, my 165 still has access through here. If I took a card here, I cut it off. So I'm making sure my 165 has access to pink and black at all times. So if one of them goes in on me or hurts me or betrays me, like if he comes in here, I can retaliate. If black comes in here, I can retaliate. Purple wants me to hit black, and I don't really want to. I'm sorry. You're playing very well uh, in your rough position. I mean, card blocked in South America is part of how North America or uh, South America being card blocked is kind of how classic works without portals. So uh, black wants me to hit pink. Pink's trying to... Ah. Uh... Okay. I mean, if, if he hits pink considerably, I will kill pink. The problem is, if he only hits pink a little bit, I can't do that much about it. He needs to go hard. Because I'm not going to kill 100 troops or 90 troops for 5 cards. I'm only 40 ahead. I gave him a thumbs up. He asked, let's hit pink, thumbs up, thumbs down. And now he's not hitting pink. So, what does that tell you? Although, like, how, how can he actually trust me, though? He could run his 40 into this stack and then bring 83 over or bring half of it over to guard. And I would kill pink. But he doesn't know that. So that's a giant risk he takes. Okay, he hits the 6. And the 5. But I need more than that to... Uh... <clears throat> I need more than that. So how do I how do I contribute to the hitting pink thing? With without starting a war with pink. I have so many troops. So many troops. I'm trying to... I, okay. I want to work with black. But, okay. If I hit a bunch of threes and break pink. Pink 77 probably hits a bunch of mine. Maybe suicides me. And if pink suicides me, black gets his cards. And he gets attacker's advantage. Could actually ruin me. And black has full access to me with both stacks. Now that purple's not guarding here. So, like, if pink suicided me properly, black might be able to just really take control of the game. So, what do we do? Is pink going to go break North America after that? He opens my stack up to black again. Which I like. Is he going to... Okay. Tension's building. I know black's unhappy with me, but I've... If, if you're watching, I, I'm, I'm open to ideas on how I could have tried to help with pink there without putting myself at giant risk. Because if he hit pink considerably more and dropped this to like a 60, if, if pink had five cards and 60 troops, not 100, I would have killed him. But black, how do I signal to black that I would do that? And how does black know? Black already hit 11 or 12 troops. I mean, that was good. He signaled we, we do this. How do I follow that without... At the same time risking the suicide. Because I didn't have a position to kill Pink. I would like to kill him out of nowhere. Not hit him a little bit and take retaliation. Although I might have a chance to do it now. If this 47 hits the 85. I'm going to have a chance to kill Pink. No. It doesn't. He's looking to kill Pink. Purple's going to come out now maybe. Um, I'm not rocking the boat. Things are looking very good. Sometimes you, we have another big trade. We This game has been incredibly lucky. I've been getting big trades every single time I've had a big trade. Even when I don't have a trade on four, I get the card I need on five. Um, I've got to hold... Australia after killing red and I made up for that kill. He's... What's he going to do here? Is he going to go in and break him again? Lost five on a one. No, he's taking Australia from me. Okay. 
So he's a little bit mad at me. Okay, he wants to go turtle in Australia now. Interesting. One card, 101 troops. So he wants to become the Australian turtle because Black scared him out. I'm okay with that. Uh, the twos didn't... Uh, one of the twos defended for three. Purple wants me to hit black. Why don't you hit black, bro? Should have taken out pink in Asia? I thought about it. Black is thinking. If black killed pink here, I would kill purple. <laughs> but he doesn't know that. This is another thing. If black was okay with second and did that, he doesn't know I'm going to do that. He doesn't know what I'm doing. Is he going to take... Africa, or just... Is he going to stack here and card block him? Because I would take pink out of the rest of the spots then. Okay, he's chilling. His stack is beside mine. Um, interesting. Uh, we will take the Euro plus two. Black's still sending me hearts. Uh, I think I have double cavalry again. But we'll get the cards we need, because we do every time. <clears throat> Give him a thumbs up. Purple's coming out. He gets cards now. Okay, now we have a four-player game again. But two people are considerably weak, and Black is reasonably strong, and I'm very strong. Purple's coming out with his stack. I wonder if he's content to kill somebody and take second, or third. Pink's going to finish Australia, come out to Siam, or is he going to go to Indonesia with this stack? Is he going to lock it or open it? He's got it open. Okay. Now what do we do? Purple breaks black. He does it. Black breaks purple. No, yeah. You've already got an enemy in pink. I don't think you want an enemy in purple. He's going to knock this pink one out. And then fortify to where? To here? To here. Oh, he breaks purple. Okay. Honest to God, the, there's no reason for me to do anything right now. And he's going to fortify here behind purple. And leave his 112 trapped. So I'm going to open the 112. Right? Um, preferably I open it. Just a little circle, taking some territories. No harm done there. What's up, uh, B. All Cameron? Uh, thank you for the Prime sub, bro. I appreciate that. Good morning to you. Welcome to the stream also. That was a pre-suicide heart from Black. <laughs> it felt like it, but it wasn't, apparently. But now Black, Black, so Black is fighting pink and purple. I'm fighting nobody. Pink's being very defensive, turtling. Okay, purple's going to hit me. Black breaks purple. Purple comes in on me. You could have came through here if you wanted to break black, but he's going to break black this way. I'm okay if he's going to hit black a bunch. I don't mind losing those stacks. What's the extent of his thing? Is he going to take North America, hit the 26? He's not going to hit the 112. If he's fast enough, he hits the 26. Come on. You got this. One more. Come on. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Why can't you be faster? If you were just a little bit faster, you would have hit the 26. Ah. So close. So close yet so far. And in the end, it doesn't even matter. Yo, dropping another Prime sub. Kryptonian, thank you, bro. I appreciate that. Kryptonian, for those of you that don't know, Kryptonian9001 in Twitch chat is the man who helped me redesign my new logo for YouTube and Twitch and my uh, homepage background on my YouTube channel. He's very talented. He offered to do it for free, too, because I'm a broke ass. I, the redesign was like a little bit over a month ago, maybe two months ago, but I was very thoughtful. He reached out and did that for me. Uh, what does Black do? Does he kill Purple? 
If he kills purple, I probably kill pink and then black give black second. Like, okay, if black kills either of them, I will give black second. But will he actually do it? He's going to full stack here. Okay, so purple doesn't have access to uh, breaking my bonus this time. Artillery and double artillery, double cavalry. Hey, Mallory, thank you for the hundred bits and Maddie for the five. Appreciate it. We're getting really close to being able to win the game. If it was a three player game, we would have the troops to probably kill two people at once. Uh, these two for sure. Purple and black, maybe. Pink and black is like more rare, but depending on like. If one of these players just um, was not in the game, we're like pretty much game ending position right now. Especially purple on four cards. I'd kill him, take a double trade and be able to punch black and kill him. I'd probably just win. If pink didn't exist. Pink doesn't break me. Probably not a bad idea. <laughs> okay, purple takes North America and goes here. Hmm. Anybody listening to the stream with high volume? Did you have a coworker look at you when that sound played? Anybody watching YouTube on high volume? Did you have a coworker, a family member look at you when that sound played? Because that's why that sounds there. Uh, thank you, uh, Garius, for the uh, for the 500 bits, bro. I really appreciate that. He's killing purple. Well played. Uh, if the five on one fails, I will actually laugh, and that would be amazing for me. It does not. My sister looked at me, and now she's winking at me. Random drone. Is she your sister, or is she your stepsister? And how stuck is she right now? That's what I need to know. If he hits pink, well, I'm already going to kill pink and then give him second. I've already decided. He lost 10 on that. That's fine. <clears throat> Thank you. I don't have a trade. Don't block him. I need to come through with my 200. I might have to come through with my 200. Two hundred and twenty-two to kill 160 something. Good. <laughs> you better believe I'm putting 21 troops in to kill these ones. I'm not screwing around with true random dice. I'm not. And as I said, if he kills purple, I will be giving him second, and we do do that. Uh, big trade into big trade. I I've had the best cards of my life today in this game, so uh, very pleased with that. Now we're just going to clean the board. I'm going to try something funky, though. What do you guys think the odds are that... A 5 can beat a 51. Uh. Uh. <laughs> well played, bro. And uh, good game. Best of luck. Hopefully, I, I really enjoyed playing this game with black and pink. Uh, hopefully, they catch the video and uh, leave a comment if you were part of this game. Uh, well played. That was fun. That was a really fun game. Anonymous from Germany. The lady with the hidden risk name. Takes the W. Let's check our ranks. Black was intermediate. We had blue was novice. Purple was novice. Pink was grandmaster. And red was novice. Pink was grandmaster. Yeah, he played well. So, yeah. I actually, black played really well, too. Uh, a lot of respect to black. I don't think he deserves intermediate. I think he deserves a higher rank. And uh, if he keeps playing, he's definitely going to get there. If he's not already an alt account or something. Uh, if you watched in from YouTube, thank you for joining till the end of the video. Please subscribe to the channel. That was a great game. And uh, yeah, catch you tomorrow for some more Risk.